Alan from Simon Woods. Uh, dot com. I have a Southern Italian wine here. Uh, Teodizio uh, Alianico del Vulture 2013. So from we're in the province of uh, Basilicata, which is uh, something right down in southern Italy. And 100% um, Aglianico. Uh, let's give it a whirl. And comparison with the uh, Barolo um, and Barbaresco, um, yes, I can, I can fully see where people are coming from. There is this as well as that bit of the colour and those uh, gentle fruits, there's a little bit of floral fragrance. There's a slight benevolent rustiness. What do I mean by that? Sometimes I get this uh, uh, whiff of uh, ever so slightly rusty uh, rusty iron in Barolo, and um, it sounds like a horrible character to uh, uh, to have in a wine, but it really does add to add to the personality. There's freshness there, there's tannin, there's this grip of tannin, and, uh, but there's a coolness of acidity there that's keeping it fresh. It's not massive alcohol, 13.5%, so it's, it's broad-shouldered, but it's not sort of gone to the gym too much. It feels, um, it feels like a wine that, uh, uh, well, I'm on, to, I'm on Boeuf Bourguignon tonight, uh, maybe it should be Boeuf Basilicata. Uh, I think it's pr at this stage in its evolution, it's probably more ribeye friendly than, uh, than stew friendly. Uh, I think I think with a with a bit of time in in bottle it would get more stew friendly rather than ribeye friendly, uh, but um, but I think it's going to go go rather nicely because there is this freshness there, but there's also this fullness of flavour and there's this mix, nice mixture of um, fresh acidity and bitey tannin uh, with this juicy plump plumptious fruit. I think I'm going to rather enjoy it. Uh, I'm going to be sharing the bottle with my wife, but um, I think she'll enjoy it too. Thumbs up. See you soon.